Hello everybody, my name is Ace Face. I'm actually here just uh, a few, maybe like I think six hours after I did my latest exploration run or combat site exploration run in the Drake actually. And something has happened actually, something annoying has happened and this is why I want to show you guys. Uh, namely, you know, remember when I was doing exploring last time for you guys who watched the video before? I went past the Triglavian system, right? Yes, I went past the Triglavian system. Can I please dock, please? How many times do you want me to across the docking? Thank you, thank you. So that Triglavian system, which was actually this one right here, Kulelen, this one right here. This system is conquered by Triglavians. Now, I did not know that Triglavians still exist in high sec. I thought that they were completely gone. This is something that surprised me. I was just like, what the heck, Triglavians? Emerging conduits? But no, I did not find any emerging conduits there. But there are Triglavians in high sec, so you can find these roaming fleets there. And it is it seems to be pretty, pretty, pretty deadly. Uh, they seem to, you know, Triglavians are obviously pretty deadly. But I didn't think much about it. I was just thinking, yeah, whatever. It's just a bit of Triglavians. But there apparently are gate camps. Gate bloody gate camps in Kurelet. So what happened now, I was just about to return my ship to Jita because, you know, you guys know my, my home is Jita. So I wanted to, to return to Jita from where I left off just to get my ship back there. And I had, there was a bunch of, there was Triglavians in the gate. So what I did was I overheated my MWD and I went to towards the gate and just went through. So this is like annoying because i'm kind of trapped here because there's no way for me to get towards jita apart from going for this kulele system i've actually tried going through a different route and i've actually not been able to actually get out uh, this is the only way so i'm thinking of using this cloaking device to be able to get through this triglavian blockade so let's see if we can get through the triglavian blockade this is going to be an interesting thing uh something quite daunting as well that i've not tried before but hopefully we will pull through now I'm going to, let's see now, let's just deactivate a few modules here to get this cloaking device online. There we go. So what I'm going to try here is I'm going to be trying to use the cloaking device to be able to cloak so that they can't, you know, lock me up. And then I'm going to just slowly but surely cruise away and then uh, yeah, I'll warp out when I'm really far away from them. Let's just see now if there's any inertial stabilizers near, but inert. That cloaking device is actually for a pretty penny. What if someone actually put it here just to mess with me because they knew that there are people here who who are uh, desperately wanting to get out of the system. <laughs> Wait, is this uh, the place here? Six, moon six. Yeah, actually, we can dock here. Let's buy these inertial stabilizers and put these inertial stabilizers in to give us a bit of a faster align time just in case because we really don't need any DPS here. This is, we're not planning to fight. I don't plan to fight uh, Triglavians because the Drake is powerful, but it's not powerful enough to fight Triglavians. It's going to get insta-wrecked. Uh, and I have no idea if the Triglavians are going to call in reinforcements. Maybe the Drake could take out the small fleet that was there before when I tried to warp through because it was not a particularly big fleet. I actually lost my Rattlesnake that was worth, I think, 1.2 billion or something like that about half a year ago, or many, many months ago. And it, actually, we don't need that many. Just, uh, let's see now, put this in here. Just want to see if we can get the align time to be under. Okay, it's there, just under, under five seconds. There we go. Okay, but I, I got actually killed before when there was the Triglavian invasion, you know, the classic Triglavian invasion then actually there was these systems, you know, getting invaded and being converted to Triglavian systems. And they actually, oh, a lot of dens and refuges here. That would have been actually quite uh, good to do some exploration here. But I want to just see if I can actually get out of this system actually first, because <laughs> I'm a little bit less concerned about these, about these anomalies right here. Would be nice to farm them though. So I went the similar way i'm doing now i went through like a gate to be able to go to a different system and it was through a triglavian system and there were triglavians on the gate and in these invasion systems there was a lot more triglavians than what i just encountered so this before i started filming this i then went i went through this gate and there was tri triglavians on the other side but this flip force that is on the other side of this gate right here it was not at all as big as the time where the invasion was where there was this like triglavian minor victory system i was in that had like a massive fleet many layer sharks 
many Dracovax, really big fleet. Uh, here is a lot smaller, but I think I maybe could take them on with my Drake, but I don't want to. I don't want to chance it because I know the Triglavians. They are very cunning. They don't like to play fair, and they I've seen them call in reinforcements in various ways, uh, in different ways, like the, these emerging conduits that used to exist, these kind of sites which you could warp to and just kill a bunch of Triglavians. Sometimes they in Triglavian owned systems, they would actually call in a big fleet, They're just like that. I was like, what? Well, they had no chance. But let's see how this goes. Let's see how this goes. Okay, let's go to the other side and try to get out of here. It's Triglavian system. I am aware, but I hopefully we'll pull through. Now I want to create a vector that's kind of like outside the. Okay, guess what, guys? Anticlimactic right here, but there's no, there's no Triglavians on the other side, so I can actually, to be honest. <laughs> oh, that was that was that was pretty, that was pretty anticlimactic right there. But I was just here just a few minutes ago. And there was a bunch of Triglavians attacking me, webifying me, and uh, getting through my shield, actually. Let's see, I wonder if they are on the anywhere. Let's see, now we've got this filter here that I can use to look for Triglavians. Let's see if we find any anywhere. Any Triglavians. Oh, there we go. This looks like the fleet that I actually encountered before. Oh, that's a lot of Triglavians. That's a lot of Triglavians. I wonder if they're going to be here on this gate, actually. Hmm, let's see. Okay, they're not here on this scale. Let's just see where, if they are anywhere. I want to just see if I can locate them to any particular location. If we go here and put the scan radius to a bit smaller, I can maybe locate the Triglavians. Okay, so they're probably in this station right here, actually. Okay, they're just hovering around stations, basically, these Triglavians, and they just want to mess around with the local populations of the system in Kulelen right here. They're probably like trying to scan these stations to get information about them. And maybe they want to, maybe the Triglavians actually, they want to do another invasion or something. This is a bit strange, but a little bit anticlimactic here. Sorry guys, I, I can imagine you guys really wanted to see that the Triglavian fleet that I was talking about, but it seems like they have actually just, you know, gone, that's just just because of that, let's just see if we can see some Triglavians, let's go and look at some Triglavians, it'll be interesting to see what they are, I've always got that cloaking device, so I can activate that in case there are a lot of them, let's go here, just for you guys, we're gonna go here and just see some Triglavians, because I think it's unfair to not see any Triglavians after I hyped it up a bit like that, <laughs> okay, there we go, this is reminds me a bit of what we had before, or what I saw before, is that I saw a similar fleet to this, it was a bit more, there was a bit more Triglavians at that gate. Let's just uh, move so we can get a cloaking device. Come on, move, move, move. There we go. Cloaking device active. Okay. But this is what happened. Like these these guys, these scrubby Triglavians. Look at this Kikimora. Looks, um, I really like the model of the ship actually. But these scrubby Triglavians, they were sitting there outside the gate. It was like this squad, and I can imagine there was another squad of other people as well. Like an, I can imagine this was this is like one squad and then there's different squads around the place. So maybe they were like there was another squad that joined up with them to patrol the gate or something, I'm not sure. Hmm. They're moving towards me actually. What is this? Are they moving towards me? No, he's not moving towards me, he's moving here. So you see these guys, they're scanning the various objects here. So they're scanning this uh the sentry gun here. They're wanting to see information, and I think, I have a feeling that these guys are going to invade again. I don't know what this is going on here. This is maybe like some Easter egg or something, but, or maybe it's just I'm completely oblivious and there's something that's really obvious, but uh, it, this seems very interesting, actually. Like the Triglavians are back. The Triglavians have not left known space. They still seem to be here, and they're still scanning around like the little scrubs they are, attacking people without any uh, any warning on gates. Killing people on site. I, 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 if I wasn't uh, uh, like I didn't use my brain and decided to just try to warp out, maybe I could have actually been killed by those Triglavians that were there before. But yeah, okay, it's all right. Maybe I'll do some investigation here actually in the future uh, time. Actually, it'll be quite interesting to see what kind of things that you can actually find in these systems. I've I've heard some things that people are able to farm these sites. I, I have a friend who's. Uh, or two friends who've mentioned things that they found some way to attack Triglavians, but I'm guessing this is what they meant. Uh, I've never actually seen this before. I just thought maybe this was like a Pochven wormhole thing or something like that. 
But this is like a proper, you, you got these, you've got these Triglavians here. They're just uh, going around just like before in the invasion, attacking people on site, just like that. It's pretty scary, actually, pretty scary, actually. So I'm going to make my way back to G2 right here. Hope you guys enjoy tagging along there for that little trip through the sister of Kulelin. Getting through the Triglavian blockade, they just decided to go off duty. Maybe they were on their lunch break or something when I decided to go through. <laughs> because I was thinking, that, oh, I'm going to go with the cloaking device. I'm going to go with these inertial stabilizers to go really fast and everything. And it just seems like, oh, wait, whatever. They're not even there anymore. They, they went to the lunch break. They got bored. All right. Hope you guys enjoyed this video right here. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe. I'll catch you guys later.